Can this cause uh, what you and I might consider, or most people might consider, quote, strange behavior? I think it could, or it could cause seizures. And some of the, the scenes that she's been shown in make you wonder whether she's had a mild type of seizure. Certainly, if I saw someone acting that way at church or at another meeting, I would probably approach the person and say, are you okay? This odd behavior, I, I think, was exhibited. I don't know if a lot of Americans saw this when she uh, testified before the Benghazi committee. Uh, that testimony went on for approximately uh, 11, 12 hours. It was, it was very, very long, and Americans probably only saw little snippets of it. But we have about a 19-second piece of it, which I think is very, very odd. Roll tape. Who else was at your home? Were you alone? I was alone, yes. The whole night? Well, yes, the whole night. <laughs> well, I don't know why that's funny. I mean, did you have any in-person briefings? It's, I don't find it funny at all. <laughs> I'm sorry, a little note of levity at 7.15. I don't know why that's funny. Would you consider that kind of an odd reaction when the, the matter is extremely serious? We're talking about the murders of four Americans and uh, national security information that may have been leaked and compromised because of this woman. That's odd behavior. I think it's certainly inappropriate laughter, which, and it's prolonged besides, that can be a sign of traumatic brain injury or the neurologic problem. Of course, there were other problems that, that interview too, is why was she at home alone while everybody else in her department was at work? Who was making the decisions on that dreadful night? Right. It's a good question.